There is something which causes more than 11,000 injuries a year, and you are probably doing it every day. Guess what? It's texting while walking. So, do you always text while walking or driving? Maybe most of us will say yes. If you observe the pedestrians anywhere, you will easily find someone whose fingers are dancing on the screen. But have you ever fallen down or run into someone while doing this? That's a problem. Trying to figure out this question, we have made an online questionnaire and conducted an experiment to explore people's attitude and actual reaction of texting while walking or driving. Before all these things, we have a hypothesis that texting may be the most influential way among different usages of the smartphone, and most people may not concern too much about texting while walking. In our questionnaire, we ask people about their perceptions and habits about using the smartphone, and the results are here. Among all the 77 participants, aging from 18 to 52, over a half agree that it's potentially dangerous to use smartphones while walking or driving. But still, most of them do it. As a result, about 40% of them have encountered accidents because of this. Looking into people's activities on smartphones, it's surprising to find that social networking sites and instant messaging applications take up three quarters among all the usage in these situations. By the way, 34 people out of 77 claim that they can spare attention from their cell phones to watch for danger. So is this really true when facing accidents? To know more about the reaction speed of people while they are texting, we went through an experiment. The tools include a computer, a smartphone, a pen, and a record phone. To complete this experiment, the subjects need to play a game on the computer, which can test their reaction speed under five different conditions. Namely, texting, reading, listening, speaking, and a normal condition. The text under each condition needed to be done three times. The results are recorded on the record form. The experiment result gave us an overview of influences due to several kinds of smartphone usage. As we expected, texting could have increased our reaction time. The average reaction time among the test subjects, aging from 18 to 20, is about 317 milliseconds. While this figure is elongated by 78.8 percent when you are texting and 32.8 percent when talking, which may indicate that using your smartphone while walking is definitely a bad idea. Texting being the worst one. From the results of our questionnaire and experiment. We can see people know that texting may be dangerous, but the urgency to text and the confidence of their reaction ability are stronger than the worries about texting. And texting indeed makes reaction slower than usual. So, why texting can produce this kind of latency? When we facing the external world, we can use many sensory organs to feel our surroundings. But if you use your phone while driving or walking, a large amount of your attention is put into the tiny screen. The other information and sensation will be inhibited to some extent, which is a reasonable effect of concentration. So, you may not get a clear and instant feeling of surroundings. Meanwhile, texting is a kind of behavior which contains seeing. Moving, thinking simultaneously, which means you need to pay more attention to the phones than just speaking or browsing. This produces a multitasking interference on the ability to identify changes in the environment. When you're concentrating on your phones, what you see will like this. Maybe, unfortunately, there is someone walking towards you, and boom. It shows a phenomenon named intentional blindness, which means you concentrate on the item, meanwhile you become blind to other things unconsciously. This kind of unconsciousness will blind you from the possible dangers.
besides pedestrians, drivers shouldn't tax on the road either. The United States Department of Transportation reported that cell phones are involved in 1.6 million auto crashes each year, that cause a half million injuries and take 6,000 lives. On the condition of the high-speed driving, the driver's one-second inattentiveness may make the car go straight for 15 meters, which means the distance with possible dangers will decrease. So either way, drivers should not use smartphones while driving, especially texting. For our workers, think twice before you want to text on your phone on the way.